Good morning. The leaders of Scotland's four main parties join us live this morning. You know, you're taking control of your own affairs, having control but over America has tax, control of its own affairs. Control over America, has, taxes, America, France, having control Germany over things control like over air passenger duty. Nicola, the all of these countries already powers. have that. Now, what is it? Look, Nicola, you've got a magic wand. You, you don't have any you policies. You, you, you have to ask me a you, question. Let me ask you a 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 question. Go on, go on, Nicola. Let me have a chance. Go on. No, I want to ask you a question. <laughs> no, no, you, you, you can ask me. You haven't come close to answering your own question yet, Nicola. He's happy to bandy about the billions. Right, 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 and the well, abolition of the Barnet formula. About and I billions. worry so that Scotland's going to be caught in a pincer movement. A pincer movement between the SNP and the Come next on. leader of the Tory right. party. Well, well, I think it's support for right. the fiscal economy and, 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 and the abolition of the Barnet formula. formula. You I don't want Scotland to be caught in that pincer movement between Boris Johnson and the SNP. You admitted on Wednesday night in the previous debate that Labour would have more cuts if elected to government. Now, you voted for £30 billion of cuts. You say that's not Well, tell me, how many billions? You said there would be cuts. Ed Miliband says there'll be cuts. Ed Ball said there would be cuts. You like banding about billions about the SNP in billions. How many okay. more cuts is Labour going to introduce? Just, just yeah. because, just no, an answer. Answer. How many billions? We'll move on to that. Just because you can't answer the question. Can I just establish whether we've got a different answer? Can I just establish whether we've got a different answer? Can I just then? Nicola, I'm not going to show you up. You've done that yourself already this morning. Come on, answer the question. How many billions? We have a different view, Nicola. But how many billions? You say there'll be cuts. How many? Nicola, you're thinking like a Tory. There's different ways out of this. You don't just have to cut your way out of a deficit. We grow our way out of a deficit. We grow our way out of a deficit. The deficit by a high deficit. Why do you find that so comical? You just made my the argument fact, for me. The fact is that we can invest right. in people without the seven points. Can I dare to come back to a matter
referendum. In your manifesto in 2016. Something would have to change in order for it to be a no. I want to say one quick thing. Very, very quickly. He's had more than a share. Please, Gordon. You mentioned David Cameron several times. I'm very clear. This will... The Scottish Labour Party will not have in its manifesto in 2016 the idea of a referendum. Oh, will, there, your a will, your, will your party? <laughs> no. Nope. Will your party no, really? Certainly not. Will well, yours, Nicola? I've made my position clear. Well, no, 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 that's the answer you have. One question on words like They don't believe in the right of the Scottish people to decide. I do. Hang on. Very good. Very quickly. Very clever debate and tactics. No, no, I'm asking you. I'm asking you straight question. Are you planning to let the fact that before people vote in 2016 has more new members than it has old members? Before they have to be asked questions at your conference. I want to know if a referendum is one of those questions. A lot of people watching this program are interested in a range of things. I want to move on. Why do you find it so hard to because repeat today I what you believe, said before the referendum? I believe you ruled it out for a lifetime. Of the Scottish Life has people. become very short I if that's a period of a lifetime. I right. believe Nicola, that we all, we all do, Scotland and you gave them a the Nicola, the you gave the people a promise before, in September that there wouldn't be another okay, referendum. We need to move on. We need to move on. No, we need to move on. Sorry, we need to move on. It's been a tough five years, but we've come a long way in five years. He said there's no money left, and his government said that. And we need to finish the job to get more people back. Well, hang on, let, let, let Willie yeah, Rennie have a shot. Not, he's he's hardly had a word in Edgewood. The people, people <laughs> stuck in the exploitation right, contracts and the people on the, the lower wages. Willie Rennie. 21,000 people across well, the UK. Hang, hang on, Ruth David. Come on, let Willie Rennie have a shot. Labour councils. Why does 68 of your Labour MPs have to stop it? Okay, Willie Rennie. It's child poverty. Yeah, because it was falling and now it's rising again. The latest published figures. This is clearly one she prepared earlier. Much has changed since 2011, and the latest published figures show decreases in the number of children. Children living in poverty. Okay. poverty. We right. should point be point proud of the people out there that we are Nicholas making. <laughs> people out there know poverty's rising, whatever Ruth might want to say to the contrary. This is but you. anyway, you wrote back this. To this is your picture and your signature. We should be proud of the poverty, poverty we're making. Is rising. This is your welfare cuts kicked child in and then it's strategy for Scotland. Again. It is a fact. Oh, it's child poverty in Jim. Scotland. Jim's has not been honest at any point under the last Labour government in Scotland. That is from your own figures. Come on, people watching. Nicholas Sturgeon, let you speak. We just want to well, hang on. You, 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 you want to respond to this point? Just give us Nicola, an answer. Nicola, I'll take no lessons in honesty answer. from a party leader who an can't answer. even rule out a second referendum. Give us an answer, From a party Jim. leader who this morning Look, can't this even explain scene. why you will take Scotland this out of the UK scene. state pension system and why you take Scotland out of the UK child benefit system. Look on a sec. If you don't trust her, why are you going to deal with her? Nicola, you're saying this is about fear. This is about facts, Nicola. Let's stumble over some facts well, here's a here. Fact. You would take Scotland out of Let's the UK try. pension system. Well, you would take Scotland out Labour? of the child benefit system. Mark, and that we want to, to get full employment in the, this country. Right, we okay. want to get Rennie, everyone who wants to do it and is able to have a job. Willie Rennie, Willie Rennie, Willie Rennie, Willie Rennie, Willie Rennie, hang on, we've had enough of the Institute of Physical Studies. We've now got liberal Democrat documents. Excellent. We've increased the minimum wage above inflation. We will increase some taxes. We have taken the low paid out. We've taken the low paid out. Of of 20, we, we wouldn't change the benefit cap at the moment, that £26,000. Are you in favour of the benefit cap? Well, well, your voters we, are. We, we accept that the benefit cap should stay at £26,000. Well, no, hold on a You've second. You've got £7.6 £7. £7. £7. billion pounds of rights. Right. Right. Hang on, we're nearly out of time. And Ruth Davidson hasn't had a chance to explain why she wants to cut people's benefit, or at least the benefit cap. Why don't we just ask those people who earn the most? Everyone's saying there's a better way of doing this, but they're all agreeing we should have a benefit cap. They're all saying that we should raise the minimum wage above inflation, which we've done. They're all saying that we should lower tax for the lowest earners, which we've done. Why don't we ask those coalition. people who earn the most? So you would lower it to twenty-three thousand pounds, just no, to be clear on that. Look, to pay right, for the we'll type of social justice, the, the program, program is finished. finished. Is it? Thank you all very much Thank indeed. You. <laughs> Thank you very much. Join us next Sunday from eleven o'clock oh, on really? BBC One Scotland. Until then, goodbye. <laughs>